everyone! So, as a heads up, I'm a little sick while recording this, so I might sound a little bit worse, but... Uh, I will talk about some stuff later, and I kind of want to talk about what I'll be talking about with this update cycle, but I'm mainly just going to cover the news today. I will talk about the brand new main weapons, the Slosher and the new Splowling, in their own video on the main channel. They'll probably drop Monday. The analysis drops tomorrow. That got a bit delayed. And, uh... I'll be talking about the weapon kits on the second channel, as always. I will talk about the Brawler one tomorrow. I want to play it a little bit today first, so I de-rust with it, and I've kind of ignored that weapon for a year. I know, auto-bombing, Jet's ridiculous. I agree. I posted a bet about it on my Twitter. Just give me a little bit, and I'll give my full thoughts tomorrow, because I got a lot to say about that weapon. Uh, a very good kit, though. For now, I just kind of want to cover some of the side news we got. And, uh, yeah. So, we have the stage. I think the stage will actually be a lot better in Splatoon 3. Because you can, like, egg throw from this side of the map to the other. And I think what made it felt terrible in Splatoon 2 is having to, like, get eggs from this side of the map across always felt awful. Like, having a fan back and forth or going around the long way or anything there was just terrible or, like, great jump. I think the fact that you'll be able to just toss eggs across, possibly into the basket itself... We'll make this feel a lot better. I usually prefer if the Splatoon 2 stage has got a few changes, but I think this is one map that will just feel way better being in a game with egg throw. Uh, we got the new rewards, and uh, I am saving up for the legendary cap. I want to get it, and it's even got last ditch effort, so yeah, I'm, I'm pretty excited about that. We got that revealed today. And uh, this is coming. We got Big Run, and we have a new Grisco weapon which some people were confused what it would be, and they didn't really make it clear that there's a new Grisco weapon in the Splatoon NA tweet. Good job, Splatoon NA. Big runs on Umami, by the way, like, day one of the season. I actually really like this. I like that this big run is happening right when the season drops. That's really good. Uh, but yeah, it's going to be a dually, pretty much, like, guaranteed. This is a post over here kind of detailing it. So yeah, go check out this person for making this post. But yeah, uh, pretty, pretty obviously a dually. <laughs> So I think we will get it there. I'm very curious to see what they'll do. I'm very excited for Grisco Dooley personally. I wanted to see a Grisco weapon for every class, and it feels like that's finally happening. The last post here is just the oversized t-shirts, which I talk about. And then uh, there's the Deep Cut Splatfest that was posted about yesterday. You get some new emotes and uh, amiibo, which is cool. I've seen some people try to justify the amiibos as, hey, there's more to the season. You're getting the amiibos. The amiibos are paid content. They don't know. These are extra. These are outside the season. If these came free, which, no, that wouldn't make any sense, then okay, but it doesn't. This is extra. Yeah, uh, I'm down for Splatfest. I think it'll be fun. I like the theme. I will probably be Team Fry. Not entirely sure. I never really announced my themes. But yeah, I think it'll be cool. And uh, that's all the real small news we got. We usually don't get updates over the weekend, but luckily this bucket video ended up having so many... Or it's not this one. Or is, is the bucket video only in Splatoon JP? Hello? Or is it... Where's the bucket? Hello? Bucket video? Bucket video? Really? Okay, it's not even here. Anyway, Splatoon JP posted a, a video demonstration of this bucket gameplay, and we got a lot of different other kits. So I will be talking about some of those over the weekend. I will talk about the Brawl one tomorrow. So, yeah, thanks for watching this little news breakdown slash mini update.